Welcome, agents. It is for 1 March 2021, and it is the first day of year three. At least it is for me covering um, the game. Officially, it's probably not till tomorrow, the update. But we've been covering uh, Top 13 now for 52 weeks. Uh, we're collating the data right now, uh, making sure... All the people that have cranked out the videos get the credit for last week. And then we'll have to add that all together with all the other statistics for see who the content creator of the quarter is and the content creator of the year is. So we're going to have a lot of videos coming out here in the next week, two weeks, um, on who did what and we're going to try to get out different categories of uh, like who who the uh, best content creator that concentrated on news was or stories or builds or um anything like that the categories uh, special weekly um uh, content you know kind of like uh Kamikaze Von Doom did the Kamikaze Conflicts. Now that was actually year one, but um, or this the top thirteen is a special weekly item. Um, Woo Plays has uh, a thing called uh, uh, Woo the Community. Uh, vibes is a, a player state of the game. Um, these people have, have cranked out different content, uh, Tales from the Dark Side. Um, and and that might be its own category. So we'll, we'll see. But you're here to see what's happening in Division 2 today. Let's get to, straight to the lauded loot. And today in Dark Zone West is Pistols. South is Rifles. And in the east is Araldi Holdings. Nothing super got to go get in those categories. So Marksmanship Rifles in West End, Eclipse Protocol in Federal Emergency Bunker, Hardwire in Foggy Bottom, Richter and Kaiser, Potomac Event Center, Petroff Defense in Roosevelt Island, Rigger in Lincoln Memorial, Light Machine Guns, West Potomac Park, Overlord Armaments in Tidal Basin, Sescaveropa Constitutional Hall, DCD Headquarters, Providence Defense, Downtown West Backpacks, Bank Headquarters, Shotguns, Around the White House's Holsters, Talking about that, and a good chance to get your exotic holster. And if you watched my video on the three exotic holsters, you should be able to get some of those to drop here. Depending on if uh, you've already got 90 in the season, you can get your waveform. Um, if you have uh, uh, the general loophole, should drop you the imperial. Uh, Imperial, Imperial Holster. Wow. Sorry. Um, Tip of the Spear, Downtown East. Fenner's Group, Grand Washington Hotel. District Union Arena, Foundry Bulwark. Walker Harrison Co. at Federal Triangle. Hunter's Fury, Jefferson Trade Center. Submachine Guns, Viewpoint Museum. East Mall, Badger Tough. American History Museum, Empress International. Hannah Yu is at the Capitol Building, and it is still the legendary for the next 20-some hours. Air and Space Museum, Ongoing Directive. Southwest is Grupa Sombra, 
Douglas and Harding at Jefferson Plaza. Armor, uh, body armor at Space Administration. Golden gear at Judicial Square. Manning Zoo, Alp Summit. Aces and Eights at Coney Island Amusement Park. Coney Island Ballpark, Future Initiative. Camp White Oak, Gloves. Pentagon, Sokolov Concern, and DARPA has 511 tactical gear. Let's see what's going on in New York. Let's go ahead and go to New York, actually. So, while we're talking on this, remember that this week is... The last week, we're not really sure what's happening tomorrow. So stay tuned to the channel to see in the morning what's actually going to happen. Are they just going to extend the league? Is there not going to be anything there? Are we going to get, like, Golden Bullet next week? Uh, are they making something new this soon? Who knows? We do know that the according to the season pass up there, it shows that 13 more weeks is coming um, before something. You know, they did adjust that. So, really don't know what is going on tomorrow. And um, Massive really, I think, needs to do something. Uh, a lot of people in the last few days, a lot of content creators have been covering um, other games, especially this new demo for Outcast. Um, and I think uh, just looking at the Outcast, it's very Division 2-ish. So the people at Outcast were um, very careful to try to capitalize on some of the uh, misinformation or, or lack of information from Massive. It does seem like they are Division 2 players. So let's see what's going on in the allotted loot here in New York. Skill attachments at Civic Center. Knee pads at the tombs, which looks like it's going to be the season pass daily. True Patriot, two, bridge, uh, two bridges. Gear system mods at Stranded Tanker. Negotiator's Dilemma, Financial District. Strikers Battle Gear at Wall Street. Marikami at Liberty Island. Mask at Battery Park and at Pathway Park is Wyvern Ware. So let's head over here to the projects. Like I said, the Tombs is our seasonal pass project daily event. Our regular daily event for everybody, even the ones not paid, is the two Coney Islands and two name cleaners, two name Black Tusk. Weekly projects, Pathway Park, Wall Street, Liberty Island, uh, financial district activities, and battery park activities. 30 levels of the summit to complete this week for your exotic and extra bonus. And the Capitol building is the legendary. In the dark zone, we have dark zone south activities today. Uh, neutralize five agents, clear landmark. Uh, Discover uh, drop zones or drops from the south and extract a contaminated item from the south. And in the weekly, do six conflict matches, win two of them, neutralize 20 agents during that time or more, um, extract uh, contaminated items from any dark zone two times and neutralize tw uh, 10 agents. So here we go to the what's going on in the seasons. Remember, this potentially could be the very last day of season two. Um, but we see right here when we go to this menu that right here below the seasons, it says ends the seasons and in 13 weeks and 19 hours. So is that a season number five coming in 13 
13, uh, 19 hours? Hmm. Again, we just don't know. Make sure you use up all these stars. In fact, uh, we're going to go in here in Haven and use those. And we just need one damage shield uh, with EMP. Uh, we can do that real quick. That's another four points. And melee attack with shielded. Uh, we need to do that 20. Four more times. Um, Sir K League, remember, it was 30, uh, you know, we have to get 60 points here in two weeks. You can split it up 30 and 30 or 40 and, I did 44 and 23, but it's able to get yourself caught up. And again, there's nothing else here. You, I'm pushing, uh, right on my joystick or my D-pad and there's nothing past here. There's nothing there. See? Um, so I can't tell you what's coming tomorrow. If anything's coming tomorrow, let's hope there's something there that there's some kind of even replayable content. Now, a little sneak peek here on, uh, some of the stuff we're working on in the future. Of course, we just cranked out week 51, um, yesterday for the top 13, we're working on, getting all the data collected for week 52, and then we'll add that all together. And we're also working on our, our sniper theme, and this is a stealth sniper build um, that we're working on, and we're going to do it two different ways. For system corruption, just missing the knees here, and two, uh, and two Hannah U, or uh, y'all, and then we're going to do three y'all and three system corruption. Now, what this is doing is just right now, just even with an, uh, just a mod, I can make myself um, a hundred percent where they can't um, pulse me, so they can't tell where I am by the pulse. They'll pulse all day and not see where I am. And with the just having this headshot on here, I can still benefit from having uh, perfect uh, uh, just regular head hunter, which is something I got to work on on this build. So right here, um, what I really want is head hunter uh, a head hunter y'all. Um, and that's going to be kind of hard to get and get all these roles right. Um, so kinetic momentum is not what I want here. I, I want to be able to um, run um, the headhunter here so I can take advantage of even shooting more and uh, uh, shooting harder with the nemesis. So what this is, is when you're running around the DZ, it's hard hard for them to kind of know that you're there. So you can be that sniper in the weeds, the sniper in waiting, and just kind of sneak up on those crafty people trying to be bullies and put them down. That That's what I do. I don't hunt um, people in the DZ just to hunt them. I usually pick on the people picking on other people. And I know there's a whole controversy about, uh, um, people talking about, you know, what's fair in the DZ. The bottom line is all's fair in love and war. And the DZ is exactly that. That's one of the reasons it seems like Massive doesn't want to promote as much on PvP is because it is a, kind of a toxic environment and they get a lot of complaints for and against player versus player. So that's what's happening in Division 2 today. I really recommend that if you have not done your leagues here, uh, your, your man hunts, um, do those if you're able to go in and replay your um, 
main mission, man hunts, um, primary target. You can replay the primary targets, which is um, once you get 58, you can replay the primary target, which is Jupiter. You don't get to do all the manhunt over again. You just get to go kill Jupiter, the main mission. And here in 53, you can go kill Hornet. And the reason why you want to do this is you can get the uh, specialty weapon um, that they give you for doing the mission and, um, like the, like the healer trap, uh, the shock trap, um, and of course, Fei Lao is the Achilles pulse. And those could easily be in, just given to you tomorrow, uh, being a new year, but who knows again, a lot of, a lot of speculation, but there is a lot to do. Um, crank out your stuff, get stuff done. I know we're working. Um, I'm working very hard to get this uh, shade watch up to 3000. Of course, I've got all four of my characters up to those levels. Um, so when I gain a level that I get those things on each one. Uh, if you don't know what I'm talking about, please talk to me and uh, I'll show you the benefits of having all four characters up and through New York City. So I know it's a little longer today, but there was a lot to discuss, even though there doesn't seem there to be, uh, at first glance, a lot to do. So this is Bear Essentials. I am Bear Buyers. I hope you have a blessed day working on this and i really hope there's some new content tomorrow something that keeps us going to a bigger content drop uh, happens it looks like maybe 13 weeks from now um and i will see you